Oh no! No, I'm gonna drown! I'm gonna drown! No, no! Hello everyone, Dan here from the Diamond Minecart and welcome to another Minecraft mod review where today I'm going to be showcasing the Diving Gear mod which adds a handful of different pieces of diving equipment into your game. So this mod is going to be very useful if you're one of those players that likes to build below the surface and make the underwater house you've always dreamed of. So without further ado, on to some crafting recipes. So this mod adds four different helmets or hats or scuba gear, whatever you want to call them, into your game so that you can breathe for longer underwater. So the first one we've got is the snorkel and you're going to need two iron, two glass panes, string, two lapis lazuli and a glass bottle to make the snorkel. So the snorkel is going to allow you to breathe underwater for 1.5 times longer than normal. Now the normal is around 15 seconds so this is going to give you around 20 to 25 sorry 20 to 21 seconds of extra breathing space so let's see what this looks like on we look absolutely amazing and it also gives you a little bit of armor as well but before i test it out i'm going to show you the other crafting recipes so let me just take this off my face <laughs> So the next one is very old school and it's an ADS Tritonia. Now for that you're going to need a bit more iron because it's a bit more sturdy I guess and you're going to need some glass and some vines as well to get the ADS Tritona. Now this is going to give you double your breathing space allowed underwater which is about 30 seconds. Now let's just check this out on our on our bonds. Ah oh, yeah, that looks pretty cool. This is definitely old school. And now there's two more which we can get to over here. But first off, you're going to need to be able to craft some air tanks. So for the air tanks, you're going to need four iron ingots, two bottles, two lapis lazuli, and another iron ingot to make a single air tank. And then you can make this into a double air tank by putting two string, at the top, one in the middle, one iron ingot at the top and an air tank either side to create the double air tank. And now you can apply these to some masks. Now to make the scuba single air tank mask, you are going to need two lapis lazuli, four iron ingots, two leather and one of the single air tanks that you built earlier to make the single air tank mask. And to make the double air tank mask, you're going to need two lapis lazuli, four iron ingots, a double air tank from up here and two leather to make the double air one. So let's have a look at what this looks like on our head it looks pretty damn sweet to be fair and yeah we're just going to be able to try these out so i'm going to put the longest one on first and we've got someone i'd like you to meet it's um my little diving friend his name is piggy and um he seems to be enjoying himself here obviously he needs quite a big mask to survive underwater but we're gonna set him free and see if he actually oh no i'm gonna die i'm gonna die <laughs> oh my god that was a bit of a close one that was a bit of a close one let's just break him out of here Come on, come out. So as you can see, I am being able to swim underwater for a lot longer. Come on, because you're going to drown. Come on, you're going to drown. Come on. Oh, I'm going to drown. Crap. Oh, that was close. <laughs> so I keep forgetting that it's not going to give me unlimited amount of time underwater. So let's break this bad boy out. Come on, come for a swim, man. Come for a swim. Come on, you're ruining this holiday for me. You're ruining it. Come on. Here we go. Yeah, he's coming out. Yeah, here we go. Ah, oh, look at this. Look at him, he's spinning around like he's having a whale of a time. Wow, that was incredible. So as you can see, this is... I don't even know why I did that. That is so stupid. But anyway, so he survived, which is good. And that is pretty much what this mod has to offer. It adds a tiny bit to your Minecraft game, kind of like the mod I reviewed yesterday. It just adds that tiny extra bit to Minecraft so that you have an extra kind of boosted vanilla experience so that is pretty much what the mod has to offer and if you like what you see and want to try it out for yourself i would highly recommend trying out with something like tropicraft but apparently it doesn't work just yet but when he gets to further developing the mod i'm hoping that you'll be able to see all the coral and stuff like that underneath which would be really awesome so if you do like what you see and want to play it for yourself check out the description below i'll take you to the minecraft forums post where you can try it out and also, if you're new to the channel, then please do hit that subscribe button for daily Minecraft videos. And for all of you, a like and a favorite would be greatly appreciated too. So thanks a lot for watching, guys, and goodbye!